Well, we are excited to see the spirit team, but we're also always excited to see our next guest. He is so kind to stop by, even though he's a big deal. Levi Christ, a talented musician, singer, actor. He's won a Tony Award for playing the legendary Jerry Lee Lewis on Broadway in Million Dollar Quartet. Been in reality television, sells out venues, you name it. And I'm going to be honest with you, Beth. I'm just ex as excited to see his parents. I know, I've already hugged their necks. Yeah, they, they always, always come, come in studio, so it's fun. Uh, he is going to be back on stage for an upcoming performance at Clarence Brown Theater, playing a different role in Million Dollar Quartet. Yeah. Which How I you think doing? is so interesting. How are you? I'm, it's great to see you all. I always look forward to seeing you. Well, I was thinking about this. One, how nerve-wracking for the guy that has to play Jerry Lee Lewis. <laughs> but then how you manage on set. I mean, you take on a, a new role, um, right, but you're right. familiar with it. I mean, how many times have you performed Million Dollar Quartet on Thousands. Broadway? Yeah. Yes, over the course of the development of the show since 2004. Thousands, but I, I, I mean, I as an actor, I've, I've pretty much gleaned everything I possibly could from Jerry Lee Lewis. So when I decided to, you know, consider revisiting Million Dollar Quartet, there was one guy who's not only had an influence in Million Dollar, I mean, you know, with these four gentlemen, you know, Carl Parkins, Johnny Cash, Elvis Presley, and Jerry Lee Lewis, but in my own music as well, uh, his philosophy is just brilliant. I wanted to kind of see what Sam Phillips was all about. Very yeah. interesting. And tell yeah. us a little bit more about Sam Phillips. Uh, he had a really specific vision back in the day for, um, about uh, blurring the color lines of music, you know, and, and also he was a champion for those young men coming from poverty as well uh, and found a way to be a father figure to these guys too, which is so much fun. I mean, first of all, I love the actors who are playing Carl Perkins, Johnny Cash, Elvis Presley, and Jerry Lee Lewis. They're fantastic. It is so exciting. I'm kind of a proud papa when I sit and watch That's them do what hear. they do because they're, they're just slaying it. And uh, I'm excited to see them this thing's kill it on go stage. Nuts. Have they turned to you for some direction? I mean, you know the show probably better than anybody. <sighs> As part of helping to create that, it's such a temptation to want to just spill all of the years of, of you know, being immersed in it. But um, it's, it's actually uh, been more rewarding to just kind of sit quietly and allow everyone to have their process and then find the discoveries themselves. And it's also helped me see it through fresh eyes as well. Yeah. You know? But the guy playing Jerry Lee Lewis, Beth's right. I mean, that's, that's, I mean, that's nerve -wracking. be nerve-wracking. Right? <laughs> right here. I mean, he wins the Tony. And I love your reaction here. Were you really shocked? Whoa. Watch this. I, I was. This. I was. Watch this. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> oh, what? Oh, yeah. I didn't want anybody uh, reading me predictions. I, I don't like, I, I don't like, I didn't like knowing anything that was going on. So it really was a complete surprise to me. Unbelievable. Yeah. Okay, so let's talk about how folks, this is going to sell out fast. Mm -hmm. It's selling when, quick. I was going to say. It's selling quick. Um, we got that. And then um, w w here's the dates for Million Dollar Quartet over yep. at Clarence Brown Theater. ClarenceBrownTheater.com, August 28th through the 22nd. Unbelievable. We're opening Friday. Mm -hmm. Yeah, unbelievable. Yeah. Um, yeah. All right, and you have a concert coming up too, right? They are also added to their series, uh, an evening, uh, a tour that I did, uh, Broadway at the Keys, right. which was l one of my most successful tours. Mm -hmm. L.A. Theater Critics voted it the best concert cabaret of that year, and I thought that would be a great addition to ha bringing Million Dollar Quartet here. So that is September 23rd, and uh, we half this, okay, the house so is already sold. sold so. Oh, my gosh. I'm not surprised. Now, when it's yeah. Broadway at the Keys, they mean, like, not the Florida Keys, right? No. Because you are... No, that would be a fun... I know. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Let's you're go. All behind the, the scenes for us to do something. You sometimes. are all over the place, right? I mean, you're everywhere I look, you're, like, in the Bahamas and mm -hmm. New York, and it's crazy. Uh, no. But That's you're always it. good to come back and see us. I know that. Well, listen, you guys have been so supportive of everything. Well, and tell us a little more about some of the projects you're working on in addition to all of this, because I know you're always That's creating. No, he's always creating. I know you are. Always I, I thinking, I, I always writing. I can't sit still. Uh, you know, um, the funny thing about this production, Million Dollar Quartet, was prior to even knowing that this was happening, I was already diving back into the life of Sam Phillips to help me inform my own music. So I have a new single coming out September 20th, which really goes back to my roots and the gospel music uh -huh. that I grew up with here at East Tennessee. Yeah. And I looked to Sam Phillips to help shape that sound. And I think that's why playing Sam Phillips in this production is so important to me because he, I mean, he actually served kind of as a lighthouse for me with this new chapter for, for me. And musically. I love the old picture, the iconic picture with all four of these well-known artists. That yeah. was taken in Memphis yeah. Yeah. Um, at the it's it's Sunset Records, I mean, yeah. years ago. So it, yeah. it, it all has deep roots here in Tennessee. Yeah. 
Kansas well, State. Well, you are welcome anytime you want. You know Listen, that. Listen, don't, don't tell folks. me that. I'll yeah, no, we, you know day. you are. Uh -huh. All right. Uh, again, uh, August 28th, it's, uh, it's going to start mm -hmm. very soon, coming up. Yeah. Uh, this Go week. ClarenceBrownTheater.com for tickets, or you All can right. call the box office. It can so. be incredible. Yeah. He's one incredible individual. Thank you. Good to Thank see you, you as always.